Hi, my name is Jared, and I'm a technical support engineer here at Hawkridge Systems. This video is part of our technical support tips and tricks video series. This video covers how to create a new PCB board shape in SolidWorks and then import the board shape into Altium while also creating a new project in Altium. To begin the process, launch SolidWorks, and from the PCB Add-in tab, select New Board Assembly. Once the Select Project dialog is open, select Create New Project. We'll give our project a name. And for this example, we'll just save the assembly to the desktop. Once the default New Board Assembly has been created, can then expand the board outline part, the board extrusion feature, select the sketch, edit the sketch. At this point you can use any general sketch tools to modify the sketch. In this example however, we are going to create a board shape from another part file. To do so, I'm going to start by using Insert Component to then browse to the part file we're going to use. And then I'll place the part file. At this point, I'm going to mate the part file to the board shape. Now that the board has been mated to the part file that I would like to use for the actual board shape, you can go into the board outline part again, feature, sketch, edit the sketch, and at this point I'm actually going to select the sketch, delete the sketch, then go to the sketch of the other part file, and use Convert Entities. can now exit the sketch. And you can see that the board has now updated to the shape of the part file that I imported. Once that's been done, we can now push Once the push from SolidWorks to Altium is completed, you can then navigate to File, Open Project. And being that we are connected to PCB services, which can be seen in your upper right corner, the credentials displayed using the default credentials for PCB services, and selecting the Altium Vault option in the Open Project dialog gives us our PCB services project. You can then select the given project, open, once the project is open you'll notice that we have no documents added to the project. We will need to add a new PCB board document in order to bring in our design. We'll first add the PCB document. We can then use our SolidWorks PCB connector panel to pull the design into Altium. 
Notice we've got the board outline as well as the assembly. We can just check the board outline, apply, and notice that our PCB document has now updated to the board shape created in SOLIDWORKS. I hope this video has been helpful outlining how to create a new PCB board shape in SOLIDWORKS and then import the board shape into Altium while also creating a new project in Altium. Thank you for watching and please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel and visit our website at www.hawkridgesys.com for more knowledge-based material.